Hey, how's it going? John from Branson Cerakote here. We're going to do a quick video today that's more of an unusual item for us in the shop, more than showing a, a particular tip or trick. It's not an unusual item in itself, it's just something we don't really get a whole lot of here in the shop to do. We've done a few bows here over the last four and a half years that we've been open, but we just don't get a whole lot of them. So when we got one in last week from a firefighter that's actually drove a couple of hours to get here to drop this off for us. We thought, you know, we'll just go ahead and knock a quick video out just to show the couple of little tricks, I guess, with it and, and things that you just need to kind of be careful of and, and keep in mind while you're doing these type of projects. We've already degreased it, gassed it out, and sandblasted it at about 80 PSI to get it good and etched. And we're going to lay on flat dark earth, which is the color they chose. About the only trick with these bows is because they're kind of skeletonized, there's a lot of cutouts in there. Uh, to cut down on weight, you've got to really be careful to, to get into those little areas to make sure you don't have any light spots. So what we do is we normally will treat them sort of like you do an AR receiver and kind of dial the cone all the way down to zero, set it up to be a little bit lighter than normal and kind of float, tap the trigger, and float that coating in there. Get that entire, the, all those little areas coated like that, hang it on the rack to, to gas it out, air cure it and then pop it in the oven and tack it out, bring it out and then reset your cone out to the, the, you know, the six inch cone you want. Set your volume up to be a good nice one mil coat and then coat the entire thing. What that does just gives you a little bit of a head start in those smaller areas so you don't end up with any light areas or any shadowing. So we're gonna do that. And then I'll, as always, we'll have some pictures at the end. Like I said, it's just gonna be a quick video. So there's not gonna be a whole lot of real tricks or, or tips or anything like that with it. but. As always, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. And check us out at BrancisSaracote.com for our stencil needs. Have a great day.